Uh, next up, we have something coming to us from Kuhn Rakan. This is a jar and bottle opener at a QVC price of $22. So if you have dexterity issues, if you find yourself knocking jars on the side of the counter, breaking your glass bottles, um, not being able to get things open, now you can use leverage to get the job done and get it done quickly. Now this is my pick of the show and actually over 55,000 of them have been, spoken for, have been spoken for here at QVC. And it's a true five in one. So yes, great for your jars. Yes, great for your bottles. Those pull tabs, save those manicures, ladies. For those standard twist tops and even the small itty bitty baby twist tops, this is going to do the job. Really, it comes down to pickles, because I love my pickles. And you know what? Sometimes I have to sit and wait and find out if there's a neighbor nearby to get my pickle jar open. It's K51429. It comes home on an easy pay of $7.33. Tons of five-star reviews here. And it's been redesigned and engineered to take up less space because now it's darn near flat that you can put this in any kitchen drawer, your gadget drawer. Do you have a gadget drawer? I have a gadget drawer. Let me take you through colors. The one I have here is called red, which seems like a very obvious name. Then I have, oh, well, this is in the kitchen with Mary, so I'm assuming I should say that this is aqua. Then we have black, brick red, gray, green, ooh, tangerine, violet, and then we have it in a white as well. It's K51429. I gotta bring in my California brother, Jeremy Parker, who is joining us today. It's just you, me, and Stace today, Jeremy. Hello, I wouldn't have it any other way in Mary's Kitchen. Well, I would have That's Mary here I, too. Well, we miss Mary. And uh, and you know, also, I'm I'm filling in for Mark Charles, Massillion's oh. product. Oh. And I wanna say happy anniversary to him and Mark, his husband. So happy anniversary, guys. I hope oh, you're having a great time. happy anniversary, guys. Oh, I I'm love that. I'm holding it down for you here. Yeah, oh. and uh, anyhow, so yes, this is a must have in every kitchen and whether or not you have dexterity problems, arthritis, carpal tunnels, any of that going on, we all need that jar of pickles opened. And in fact, I brought my own pickles from my house. I brought my own jar. I ate one out of it, so I opened this last night. Sorry about that, I had to try it. But <laughs> to open up a jar, it's the best thing. And I think it was Archeles who said, give me a lever long enough and somewhere to put it and I can move the world, something like that. And this uses leverage. So all you do is just here, it has these three grip points right here, here and here. And you put it on top, you grip it. As long as you can pick it up, it's on there. I can take one finger here and just move it like so. And that'll pop that lid off. And that was really on there. And that pops that off. And then you just do that. It takes the lid off. Easiest way to open up. But the original had just the uh, jar opener. This has four other openers. So number two is your pull tab. Now, if you have these pull tabs, I'd say anybody that does a jar of anchovies or sardines, what happens when you pull it, you either break a fingernail or juice goes splashing everywhere. Mm -hmm. So no more anchovy juice going all over your table. Okay, number three, yeah. if you have a small jar, because this only goes down to about there, which is, is good for smaller things, but if it's a little smaller, then you can open this with here. Stick that in, your hot sauce, your Tabascos, your nail polish. You could take the lid off like that. Just pop that out. Did that still number have the plastic on it too? Yeah, that had the plastic. I pulled oh, the plastic right off well, of there. Well, I love that because that is like a source of contention for me. It drives me absolutely insane trying yeah. like, like using my teeth. I'm getting out butter knives. All right, keep going. Yeah. Okay, number four, beer bottle opener. I mean, how many of you just have one of these clogging up the drawer? So this saves space. It's a five in one. So number five, flip it over right here. That's your twist off opener. Put that on any of your plastic caps and just twist it. You could twist the top or twist the bottom and it'll also break that seal there too. So five in one, this is why it's really popular. I think every kitchen should have this tool. And you know, I'll tell you what, and Julia, I'm not, I'm still a pretty strong guy. You know, I used to be a, I used to be a track decathlete, many uh -oh. about 40, 40 pounds ago, but 
I still need to open these things. You know, when you jar yourself, you can your own tomatoes, mm -hmm. your own pickles, okra, whatever you're doing. These lids are almost impossible to get off if they get a little rust on them. So if you just got it for your mason jars alone, go on top here. I'm telling you, I use this all the time. Open this up. And what I love is that if you need, now this one was already released, but a lot of times this is sealed. You can also use this little popper right here to oh. pop that lid off like that. So instead of getting your finger in there. So again, you'll use this. And by the way, there's my pickles. I grew these, I pick them myself. I love these, it's my favorite. Those are your I feel like. How, what do you put in your pickles? I feel like I'm on the quest, like my, my life's purpose is the quest for the perfect salsa and the perfect pickle. Well, I happen to make both. I make the perfect salsa and the perfect pickle. No, I'm, I'm working on my pickles. My okay. salsa's done. I got that. You handled. got that so one I'm on working lock. on. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm trying all. I try different things. I, I like a little jalapeno pe pickle, mm -hmm. like a hot. Anyway. That's okay. All right. Well, we'll, we'll have to discuss <laughs> because I love a pickle. You know what? I yeah. see, Jeremy, that you have all the colors in front of you. Can we run through yeah. the colors that way? Absolutely. Can Let's I? You it. want me to run through it? You want me to do it? Sure, you do it. Show me what you've okay. got, Jeremy Parker. I'll see. You know, I didn't memorize them all, but let me get it close. So I'll first, help you. we have the aqua. Aqua. Okay. And then the brick. That's going to be your that brick red. red. Okay. Our black. Mm hmm. We have our gray. Mm hmm. We have our lime green. Yep. Another shout out to my man, Mark Charles Masilli. That's that's the tangerine. That's his favorite color. That's why I'm shouting that one out. We got that famous foodie red. You got that foodie red kitchen. That Most one's going to go. popular. This is, I think, pretty new. This is the white one. There's your. Is that, is that called white? It's called white, but only about 200 remain. If you want that white, grab that now. OK. And then uh, the violet. Violet. Right there. Violet. Yeah. You're turning violet, Violet. What's that from, guys? Anyone? <laughs> Anyone? No, Jeremy? Yeah. It's from know. Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Oh, of course. Violet. Oh, God. Oh, You're turning violet. turning violet, Violet. I actually violet. posted on Instagram that quote because I used a new Tatcha face mask that was violet. And I was like, whoa, <laughs> look at me. All right, this is going really, really quickly. And I mean, over 55,000 have been sold here at QVC. And that, honestly, that's probably an outdated number. It's probably a lot more than that. And a lot of people start their QVC journey right here with this, with Recon, with that Swiss design that has been bringing us the best of the best when it comes to kitchen gadgets, like revolutionary. My apartment is filled with Kuhn Recon because I love a gadget. I really, really do. I love something that's going to make my life easier. I love something that is going to make the struggle a little less real every day. And I love something that's going to save my manicure because, guys, <laughs> let me tell you what. This, if I could go to my manicurist, who I love, shout out to Leslie, and I could just drop my hands off and be like, I'll be back in two hours, I would. But I gotta sit there. It takes a long time. I don't want this, I don't want this to be cracked. But have you ever used that like butter knife trick? Or have you ever had that splashing? Last night, Jeremy, I was telling Stacy I made cauliflower um, Mexican Spanish style rice, and I threw in nice. some like diced up hatch chilies in there that had that pull tab. And I was like, oh, I don't, oh, it feels a little precarious. I'm almost due for to get my nails done. Maybe let's use the yeah. butter knife. Or if you find yourself not being able to get into those pickles and you're like knocking it on the side of the of the countertop. Oh, well, looky, yeah. looky. Ta-da! And that's it, really. I mean, and yeah, your fingernails there, and also it's the splashing for me because I cook with a lot of anchovies and things like that with pastas. But you know, there's a few of these other things. Maybe you have this cough syrup, mm. and you can't quite get into it. You know, you're twisting, you're pressing. So again, all you're doing is just latching this on. You see, you twist it, righty tidy, lefty loosey, and I go here, no matter what the size. And now, once that's on there, I can press, I can turn, I can break that seal and it'll open that up, even for things like prescription medicines. Maybe you have a bottle that you can't get into. Maybe it's that one that you just like can't open. Right. Go for this. You have a tool for it. So again, I can get here, give that a little press, then I can turn and open that bottle. And you know, sometimes the hardest things to open are actually these already opened, like Ooh, the barbecue sauce. Yes, the, all sticky. The, the, the syrups, things like that, that turned to concrete right there. So again, this will go on top. You just have a friend in your cupboard that's going to help you open that old barbecue sauce or even those caper jars, you know, those tall, thin jars mm. that sometimes you just quite can't grip onto. And I remember my grandmother, uh, I miss her dearly, but she used to always call me over, honey, 
Jeremy, can you help your grandma with the pickles? <laughs> I got a jar of pickles. Help grandma out with the pickles. So I would come over and I would just, you know, of course I could do it, grandma. And, you know, you're looking for a, what, a towel or some way to grip right. it. And so this wasn't invented back then. So anyway, I could have given Jeremy one of these to, to grandma. Little Jeremy to the rescue. You're so strong, <laughs> Jeremy. Open up well, those anymore. pickles. Anymore, yeah, this does it for you. It uses leverage, it grips it. You don't have to bang it against the counter like that. Right. It's it's just a, a great tool to have. We call it a gadget, but it's really a tool. Right. And you'll love it. You'll use it all the time. You really will. And when you're making martinis and you need to get to those olives, because a martini is not a martini without a twist or an olive. What are you a twist or yes, an olive person? I'm an olive. Okay. I'm a dirty goose kind You're of a guy. You're a with, uh... dirty goose kind of guy. Yeah, that's it, yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm a twist kind of gal. But sometimes, every once in a while, I was like, oh gosh, an olive would be real. Oh, speak of the devil, right there. There they are. There they mm -hmm. are, there are those martinis, or maybe just some relish for your hot dogs. I love the idea of using this for your medications because nothing is more frustrating when you're not feeling well and you need to get to your medications. You need that cough syrup in the middle of the night when you're already not we're already weakened. And then you bring this to the rescue. It's K51429. Let me run everyone through the colors because this is wildly popular. This is something that you're going to use really every single day. Over 300 now have been picked up. Let's talk about colors. I'm holding it here in the red, which is the most popular. Here come the other colors. There's the aqua, black, brick red, gray, green, tangerine, violet, and fewer than 200 now remain in the white. This has major reviews, major stars. Check them out on QVC.com. It's K51429. Um, Jeremy is sticking with us for a while, but here's something that's coming up in a little bit. Again from Kunrakan, five in one jar, nope, wrong one, 